it felt very uplifting to be in a in a room where we're talk where we're having these conversations. In our education, we have academics, we have fine arts, we have all of our STEM opportunities, we have just multi facets of education going on here. We've achieved a lot, but that's not good enough. We want to continue to evolve. We want to be versatile. We know from a branding and marketing standpoint that it's not so much about where you take your kid, but it's about how you feel when you take your kid there. In the end, everyone spoke from the heart, everybody spoke from what they believed in on answering these questions on the Champion Project. And to be a part of that and to see these answers evolve of where this district needs to go and focus in on, I thought it was very, very rewarding. I think it's uh, pretty cool that we can actually have a formal, formal process to, to fill in the gaps of, uh, of our service models, especially in mental health. I think there's a lot of um, community uh, awareness going on, but also within our school district, uh, a lot of mental health awareness you know, being presented to students and families and parents and staff members. And if we don't have the capabilities or the infrastructure to meet those needs, then of course those are the gaps that, are, that, that need to be filled. So being part of this Champion Project is, is, is an honor, and not only that, but uh, it's, it's a privilege to be able to serve our community to ensure that you know, we're, we're getting the job done as a school district. Well, I think that the Champion Project is a really very good plan. Uh, it's going to improve the district and um, where we're going, uh, the direction that we're going. I think it also helps everyone, not just one entity, but the whole district. Everybody's involved and everybody will benefit from it.